Welcome to Look Local. I'm Karen Adams. This is the place where we celebrate the best and the brightest of where we live and the distinct charm and character of Jacksonville. We do that by reminding you if you're looking for something to do or for someone to help, it is always better to look local. This week, we're speaking with Island Doctors. They have many clinic locations across the city. Today, we're focusing on mammograms and diabetes. Also, Plexiderm, it's a topical rub that you use under your eyes that gets rid of unsightly bags and puffiness. It's easy to use, and those who do swear by it. We'll find out about that. Plus, 904thin.com, a revolutionary way to get healthy and lose weight at the same time. But we begin today with Island Doctors, and Redis Smith joins us now to talk about mammograms, diabetes, office locations, and many more, including his thoughts on the political race. <laughs> <laughs> we were just messing around. I know I got to get that sooner or later. All right, so how are you doing today? I'm Redis? doing great. Feeling much better. Thanks okay, for asking. Well, I'm loving having you back. Yeah, great. Let's talk about, um, about mammograms, diabetes, and your clinics, and what you're doing right now in the community of Jacksonville. Well, believe it or not, we've came up with a uh, partner, okay. uh, Precision. Uh, Lori, our contracting person in the office, has done it. I've made a big emphasis on mammograms this year. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a big, beautiful pink bus okay. that's going to be going out, and they'll be doing mammograms throughout the city, mm -hmm. uh, mainly at our locations and also uh, in some of the church locations throughout Jacksonville. Okay, so this is a bus that, what, it just goes like, like mobile to other, to different places? Different places. What's inside the bus? Is that the, where all the equipment is? All the equipment is okay. inside. Everything they need to do your mammogram and get back with you and forward the information to your doctor. Okay. We're going to make that readily available uh, at each one of these sites. We're going to come out with a big, as you know, Jack's 4 advertisement campaign and also that on the radio and let people know look the sites and, and look local of course of course if, to, if it's not to, look local right, I got, I'm only part of it <laughs> right and uh we're gonna do that mammograms are very important I I did not know how lacking we were with women getting mammograms mm -hmm. in Jacksonville till about two weeks ago mm -hmm. and I said we got to make this a priority for the next quarter mm -hmm. uh and we're gonna do that so we're working very closely with them in order to make sure uh that that happens we're also going to be helping and working with Silver Sneakers real closely as okay, well. Tell us about that. It's the gym program and the exercise, but they have access to a lot of the senior women mm -hmm. that we're going to try to get with them and send this to their locations as well to do that. Mm -hmm. uh, Silver Sneakers is very underutilized in our city. And it's a free program for seniors, water sports, exercising, pool laps, and all these types of things that's available to them. Um, so we're going to try to ramp that up a little bit with us. Allen Doctors, I think, was one of the biggest performers for Silver, silver Sneakers for That's a while. Uh, and we just want to get our seniors back into, into doing that. It's, it's free, Karen. Sure. So we should be so doing that. So why not, that. Yeah, right? Right. right. Um, let's talk a little bit about how many clinics you have. And we have some, some shots here I want to show of, of just what you guys do. And you guys are in Jack's Beach. You're in downtown Jacksonville. I mean, what, you're out in Lake City. I mean, you're right. all over the place. We are now proudly to say that we're up to our 24th clinic. The goal is to, to get us up to 30 Okay. Uh, by end of 2018. 2018. Mm -hmm. uh, we now have a beautiful, unbelievable office in Jack's Beaches. Mm -hmm. You know, we have our North Main office here, Cassett, but we're in Gainesville, mm -hmm. Lake City. We're in St. Augustine, mm -hmm. Daytona, New Smyrna. You know, we're in Ormond Beach now. Uh, so we're moving pretty rapid to make sure that our coverage for our senior base is, is, is good. Mm -hmm. uh, and our network is really solid because I think this year, in the in the, the the highlight of election and where healthcare is going, our seniors are going to be our number one top priority for let's, the next three years. And let's talk about about that a little bit about the way you know the healthcare is going and and the way the situation is right now. What are your thoughts? My professional thoughts are that is we're going to be in for a rude awakening uh, if we don't cover ourselves now. Uh, Dr. Hemman has got this philosophy about stopping anything before it happens. Mm -hmm. That's kind of the way we're looking at things as a whole. So are you, so are you, you a know. big Trump supporter or are we talking Clinton here? I, I don't Honestly. think that I'm a either supporter. I think I would like to see the best person for the job. What I'm not think? a very big party guy. What about for health care? What do you think? I think for health care, I have to be honest with you, I honest. think why Hillary has the experience. Uh, in the political climate of health care, Donald Trump brings a fresh new perspective. A little rowdy, mm -hmm. but has that. But he has an ace card mm -hmm. that I think if he ever uncovers, 
Mm -hmm. It's probably going to do him well because he does have the business sense. Mm -hmm. And you have to give him credit for that. You can't take that away from him. Well, I thought it was um, also, I think you mentioned last time, that they were going to make health care uh, be more affordable in terms of being able to compete for contracts instead of just having a Florida-based, like Blue Cross Blue Shield or right. any of the other, other major corporations or pharmaceuticals and, and health insurance companies. They were going to open it up more on a national level. I think what's going to affect the the country from a political standpoint is that hospitals are going to have a bigger voice uh, because they're developing their own plans to kind of keep the money in the pot, mm -hmm. which in a way is very dangerous because it's almost like uh, people who don't know the business, mm -hmm. as being a form administrator of a hospital and being a form um, administrator of a health care plan, mm -hmm. the two really at this point don't mix. Right. So you have to understand that it, the pot of money circulating in one center is never a good idea, mm -hmm. like MSOs. Mm -hmm. MSOs should be privatized mm -hmm. because when something in this country is ran privately, mm -hmm. you seem to get the maximum effect. Mm -hmm. When you put something in the hands of big government, it doesn't go as well from past history. Sure. So we have to look at how can we maximize it and keep Medicare going, Medicaid going, mm -hmm. and all this. I'll tell you who's doing a really good job. The guy, the governor in Tennessee, mm -hmm. Haslam, mm -hmm. is doing a fantastic job. Mm -hmm. I think that we have to look at that mm -hmm. and, and be able to make it transparent and go. We only have about That's my political... There's your ambitious. political purpose. But it's interesting to see how, how that will affect healthcare right. going forward. And it's interesting to see how Island Doctors um, will, will incorporate some of the, the new uh, right. policies that will be in place. And I know you'll be back to speak with us about that. I sure will. Well. Be more than happy to. It's always, always great to have you, Rita Smith. Thank you. Island Doctors, thank you very much. Up next, we're going to find out about a new eye cream that everybody is talking about that gets rid of dark circles and bags under your eyes. We'll find out about that. Plus, the Jacksonville Armada are set to take on Fort Lauderdale. If you'd like to go to the game, you can log on to Armada. FC.com.